okay guys so i'm just packing up my gym bag right now i have my good life fitness bags it was branded um i got it when i registered with them um last year so yeah so what's inside i already have my gym towel this is their handbook i always go with it i have a resistance band i typically go with this as well just in case i have to shower while i'm there um what is this so yeah so i'll be wearing this but i won't wear it from home um just because i don't want to step on dirt and then have to like you know change when i get there so i usually put it in the bag um i have a socks a pair of socks as well for the shoes um what else okay so yeah so i have another towel just like a smaller one for when it gets really sweaty while i'm at the workout equipment whatever it is be it a treadmill stepper yeah and then i have my sweet sweat band so this is a sweet sweat band i wear this one to just enhance my workout right yeah so so that's the purpose of this one always good to go with a bottle of water or a water bottle whichever one you prefer um never forget your headphones guys when you go to a gym you will just be bored but um they do have their own music what i mean you know it's not like it's a nigerian gym right so the songs will not really be what you want to walk out with so i always go with my headphones never forget to go with your headphones um so even though they say that the pandemic is i guess technically over since we're allowed to use the gyms now i'm still just going with a mask because i just don't want to get there and for some reason they say oh you should have come with a mask we still require masks ah i don't want to come back home good to go with your purse in this purse i have my membership key card i think uh, i hope so <laughs> actually should have it just a second i'm gonna find it but it's usually the last heavy stuff i have yeah so yeah so this is it the good life fitness membership card and then i have a padlock because we typically have to lock our stuff at the locker room but you know the worst part i can't remember the password so guys the most interesting part is i have this key lock that is like passworded i think i put a name i just cannot remember what i used as the password for this lock <laughs> and it was quite expensive like i remember i think i bought it i don't know was it 20 dollars like i know it was expensive at the gym when i bought this lock i just cannot remember anymore because it's been so long oh my gosh what am i gonna do i can't remember the password anymore ah anyway, i'm going to throw it in hopefully there's a way they can help me reset it but if they can't then well it is what it is so yeah so this is my gym bag i'm on my way going now show you guys my beautiful gym i'm so happy to be back to the gym let's do this <laughs> hi guys and welcome to my channel in today's video i'm heading to the gym yeah i'm in the package that's why it's so dark <laughs> yeah so i'm just gonna let you guys in on my gym experience tiny short-lived gym experience so far keep watching oh my gosh, sorry forgive my manners guys thank you so much for stopping by if you're new here and if you're an old subscriber thank you so much for coming back it means a lot to me that you came back to just watch me talk really <laughs> anyway so yeah so um my gym is open now which is such good news because they've been closed technically closed since march of last year 2020 so this is basically july july 24th 2021 so they've been closed for like over a year because of covid right everybody knew when like the whole world literally shut down so even when they were oh okay you can come back it wasn't really at full capacity you had to be booking online and so in my mind they were still closed because i mean i kind of there's no way you can tell me that just to come to the gym i have to wake up early in the morning and try and like book space and cut space literally like you have to be like i don't know how to put it like you have to literally wake up at 6 a.m to book a spot for 7 a.m if you miss that spot you have to be by your phone at 7 a.m to book the next one i'm like huh just to lose weight <laughs> so yeah so no so i i couldn't do all of that i mean i work right <laughs> i have a job i cannot sit down by the by the phone just trying to get a spot at the gym so yeah so i didn't um yeah so i didn't um uh, ever 
book that space i was never lucky enough the few times i tried so yeah so that went but now um in ontario especially in the town of waterloo where i live things are back to normal i guess because i mean for them to open the gyms and like we are actually asked to come back that yay we are open yay <laughs> so yeah so um i've been doing home workouts for the past one year plus in fact i actually lost my weight like the weight that i lost during the pandemic more on that later i want to do a full like video as to how i lost 17 kgs of weight kilogram of weight you know during the lockdown but yeah so that, that can be helpful to someone who's watching me right now but i'm even more so talking about the fact that you know i started to go to the gym last year in february when i actually started my weight loss journey and um, by march you know they had closed so yeah so most of my weight loss journey exercises had to be done at home so yeah so i have a full page on instagram my calorie count life where i share all of those kind of workout moments and just stuff that i do so yeah so you can please follow me <laughs> to watch that um to see all, all of those stuff um but i think for me it's more about the fact that the discipline can actually happen anywhere so even if you're working out at home you're working out at the gym i just feel like the discipline is just key because really gym workout is good you have all the equipment you have i mean it's it's beautiful right you come in somewhere there's a lot of hardware oh my gosh yeah let's go on the treadmill oh let's go do this all of that is beautiful working out at home has the convenience which i mean i'm having to drive like nine minutes right now right just to get to the gym so yeah so this whole like thing i'm doing right now would have been avoided if i was working out at home so yeah so that's one plus right for home workout but then home workout can get boring i don't know if you're like me who well i, I enjoy i mean i use the internet and all of that so yeah so there's group group workouts because there are people on the screen and all of that but i don't know i kind of find it boring sometimes so i like going out to actually work out like outdoor working out on the street or even at a gym where i get to like see other people not like a lot of people but just like you know see one or two people it just i don't know i just like it i prefer it to working out just in the solitude of your home only you there so yeah so that's this is just me though someone else might have their own preference right and it's all fine like i said um it's i don't think anyone is better per se working out at the gym working out at home i've done both but i did the home workout for longer because you know everything was shut down and i had to like literally you know work out at home for the length of the time so yeah so that that is i mean that's there's that right so yeah so i think either one can work out although gyms of course gyms are expensive right because you have to pay for like to use their services so here i pay mm, i pay 23 dollars every two weeks plus tax so that's like 25 or 26 dollars um bi-weekly which is like every two weeks so that's about 50 something dollars a month just to use their gym so yeah so it's not something i want to do forever because i mean it's quite expensive so most times i go to the gym when i really want to be in form like when i want to get my body back like okay so yeah so you've been you've been in some kind of slacking okay maybe a bit of arm whatever coming out here i'm like okay let me go back to the gym and use the equipment and just get fit once i'm in that fit mode i'm more i go back home to continue to maintain because really at that point it's just enthusiasm that takes you to the gym because you really don't i don't think you need to go there every single time right so if you can continue to work out at home to save on that 50 bucks 50 bucks is not it's not small money if i send that money home if nothing else I know how much I'll make, right? So yeah, so this is my gym. I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm just taking a turn at my gym. Which is, yeah, so that's the gym. Good Life Fitness. Which is it there, I'm just arriving. Oh my gosh, looks like I got the wrong entry. Okay, yeah. So yeah, so that's the gym there, Good Life Fitness. Oh my gosh, I miss this gym. Like it was such a beautiful gym. Like it was so well equipped when I, you know, started to use it last year. And then I didn't even have a car. So then I used to walk from our house, which was somewhere around that area, but like behind. Like it used to take me like 15 minutes to actually walk here. But now all of that is in the past because I mean, I drive now. So yeah, I'm five minutes away by driving. And welcome to the gym with me. Let's see. Okay, so I'm just heading to the entrance now of the gym. Um, I need to find my key card because I typically have to use it there. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. Really, 
okay thankfully i think i came with one but i i thought everything was like back to normal not yet so we still have to wear masks okay all right i'm gonna just sit out here and then i'll, I'll grab my mask um but in the meantime my phone number you want to wanted to search okay so guys do you remember i mentioned that i could come here and then they'll say where is your mask so yeah so that's it guys never doubt your instincts when your instincts tell you something they open gym to full capacity and they're still asking us for masks right i didn't even know that but now i'm happy that i came with my mask so guys it's a really big gym like we have like the male section which is basically here oh no i think here um both ladies and guys can actually use here right like it's has lots of equipment like a whole lot <laughs> like i feel like it's it's almost like too much right <laughs> if you think and then we do have the women area which i prefer to walk out at which has another set of equipment here so <laughs> so it's a huge ass gym like lots of women area equipment like you can never go wrong so what they do is like okay i think oh i see so because of social distancing they kind of block off you know one um treadmill leave one open block of one leave one open i see so that means they have a lot so you can imagine how many they have for them to not even be using them like you know um what's the word i'll use simultaneously or like all of them at once right so yeah so that's the same thing they did for all of the equipment so that you're not next to someone wow this is so impressive um okay so yeah so i'm just gonna find somewhere that i want to do i think today i really want to just use a treadmill i'm not sure i want to do anything much but i'm gonna go to the change room first so guys um this is the change room the locker room for the women's section it's really huge i think about i don't know 100 or 200 lockers uh, hi guys <laughs> hope there's no one here so that i don't invade their privacy but yeah so this is it guys lots of lots of space there's like the toilet the bath area there's still another section here it's about i don't know 200 or so lockers and then the washrooms it's a really huge gym so yeah so i know they say we can actually take our bath right now but I think it's not safe yet <laughs> to me to do so just because of the pandemic. Yeah, so I think you gotta wait a bit until things really come back to normal and everyone is vaccinated before you try using the bathroom. So this was the, the lockers where I had that padlock for, but I cannot even remember my password, I told you guys because i cannot remember the password i cannot and the essence is for you know to lock up something like this right like when you open it and put your stuff in you expect it to like literally lock it up and i cannot remember my password i don't even know <sighs> god i i think i can but i'm just gonna try a couple i'm hoping i can if not i'll just put my stuff in a number that i remember and since people are not here hopefully nobody comes here to like touch my stuff So guys, I'm just gonna find somewhere to drop my bag, but things I'm going in with would be my headphones, my phone, <laughs> which I'm using to record this, my water, and my purse, just because I didn't lock it, so I don't wanna, you know, <laughs> yeah, I don't wanna leave my purse here, just in case, right? Yeah. So guys, I've been running on the treadmill for about 10 minutes. I'm so tired, like, you know these gym workouts are, <laughs> usually more strenuous if you're in your house you can just rest but this one now you have to you'll be seeing the calories counting so it's very motivating but at the same time can be stressful oh my god so i'm just resting now 
I'm gonna increase my incline and speed in a bit and run again so guys i'm actually done with my warm-up um, and the treadmill but then i came to this area where i can find some weights to lift and then i'll do some abs exercises so this is the best part of the gym actually um the best part of the gym for me is because these gym equipment are very expensive especially the weights so just knowing that i can come somewhere and have this much weights to lift <laughs> like can you see a whole i don't know about 100 of them so it's enough to go around right so yeah so that's like the huge part of it for me coming back to the gym i have the balls to use the weighted balls um yeah i have a lot of dumbbells like more than enough i tried to buy during the pandemic but it was so expensive like how many do you possibly want and how many can you possibly afford right so it's so expensive so i decided to just uh you know come this way and then at least use the like i have too much of equipment to use like that's just the beautiful part i'm so excited like i'm so happy to be back at the gym like especially now that i know what i'm doing when i even started coming here i didn't even know shit about trying to lose weight so i did all of that on my own at home but now i'm back so i know what to do when i get to the gym and now i actually have like lots of equipment so yeah so that's it <laughs> guys i think it's time to go <laughs> we have been here for about 45 minutes um because it's my first time back in a long time i don't want to overexert myself i don't want to just you know use all the equipment i see yeah i think it's important to just like start slowly when you're just getting back into the whole equipment workout and then as things go on you can increase the intensity so that's what i'm doing today i'm going home guys <laughs> It's been a long day, I don't know, maybe burned about 250 or 300 calories, I don't even care, but I'm good. I just wanted to see all what was available, you know, back at the gym, so that I can know what to expect when I come back next time. So yeah, so thank you guys for working out with me today. Not a lot was done, but um, <laughs> like I said, I'm just easing back into it. I'm just easing back into it and to see, you know, what to expect when I continue to come here. So that's it guys, thank you. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. It's important to me that you subscribe to be part of my journey. <laughs> Weight loss journey, Canada journey, whatever it is you're interested in that I currently am living in. Yeah, I think it would be nice enough to carry you along. Thank you so much. But thank you guys so much for watching my vlog. I hope it was interesting. I don't know, it was just all over the place because it's a gym. You're not really allowed to like video people while they're working out. So I had to be like... You know, putting my cameras where <laughs> my camera where you know someone wasn't there and all of that so yeah so it sucked but i hope you guys enjoyed at least just following me back to the gym and seeing that i'm so excited to be back to the gym guys like it's been a year and three months since i stepped my feet into this place so thank you guys for watching see y'all next time bye